Scorpios, welcome back to my channel. Let's take a look at what you guys are not expecting to happen that may actually take place in the near future. Now, the purpose of this reading is more so like a heads up, uh, get you prepared type of reading. Oop, let me put this here. So take what applies, leave the rest. And if you do want a personal reading uh, for yourself, this actual forecast is on my website. So check that out. It's www.mysticalcrystals.com. I will have it linked below in my link tree link with all my other links uh, that you guys may be needing. Okay. And I also go live and take personal questions. So make sure you guys hit the notification bell if you want to check out those lives to get a question answered. But first card that we have here, Scorpios, we have the house. So right off the bat, um, when it comes to a living situation, it could become very pressing in regards to you guys either feeling like you have to move or that you want to relocate. You could even find that a living arrangement just isn't working for you anymore. It could be the people you live with, the environment. Maybe you don't feel like The home that you're in resonates with you or gives you the, the ample space to do things that you want to do creatively. But with the house here, if you have been applying, looking for a place, you could get some good news about you getting a new home here or getting approved for a new place. Okay, I see stuff around the home. There even may be some repairs that you guys are finally going to be getting done after maybe waiting a long time for, let's say, a landlord to come make the repairs, or maybe you were putting certain things off because you needed the, the extra money for it, and now you're doing these home renovations. But let's keep going. We also have the man and the fish. Hmm, there may be some sort of financial opportunity that may come from a divine masculine or some sort of financial opportunity that if really tapped into could give you guys serious wealth. Because when, whenever we're talking about the fish showing up in a reading, this is real wealth. Okay, this is long-term wealth. So for a lot of you, what could be happening you could be put on to some sort of financial opportunity. You could be offered some sort of suggestion. And then this could be the start of you like starting a new career path that could really make you some money here. Like it, it's interesting. Why is the fish here? Yes, you could be having some sort of financial windfall coming after things have felt kind of stagnant or dry or may have felt like things were not progressing for you, okay? You could have some, some people who are jealous of you or mad that you've gotten some sort of promotion at work. You could have people who are definitely sending you the evil eye. So be careful of who you let know certain opportunities that you have in the works or let know what you're working on. Because you do definitely have some people who are sending you the evil eye. We also have the whip, mountain, the bouquet, ring, and the tower. Interesting. Mm. Somebody who you've had a very toxic relationship with they could be making it known to you out of the blue during this time frame that they've been having a really really hard time getting over you okay this could be somebody who may have put you through hell and back although they may be on social media presenting themselves as being 100 percent happy or being at peace with the fact that you guys are done this person could be energetically still going through it and they will be expressing that. Mm, another thing you may not be expecting to happen, again, the universe is going to be gifting you some sort of opportunity, Scorpios, to experience 
true stability around your finances and around a living situation. Some of you guys are going to be stumbling across a financial opportunity that's going to take things to the next level. Or you're going to be stumbling across a, a person where this is going to be like a life partner. This is going to be somebody who you have longevity with because we have the ring. Look at that. We got the tree. Hmm. Yeah, some of you guys are going to be leaving a job for sure where there's like this corporate corruption or this issue with like the higher ups purposely doing certain things to kind of keep the people who are, you know, working the, the regular positions at that position and not like trying to give raises, not trying to take in consideration of you. You guys are going to be leaving. For a lot of you too, you guys are going to be walking away completely from things that you have invested a lot of time and energy into, but have seen how your heart is being called elsewhere. So a lot of you are going to be closing out some final chapters, especially if you've been like holding on to like a family situation or holding on to a particular environment. I keep getting that. Some of you guys are gonna be relocating to like a different city, like finally taking that leap of faith and moving to a different city, moving to a different state, moving to a different area. Cause you could be realizing that's the only way you're gonna grow. That's the only way you're going to elevate. And luck, your luck is going to be changing. Like while you guys have been in a state of not knowing what's going on and <laughs> how to maneuver through the energy you've been experiencing, spirit is really going to be showing you guys a level of favor. You have so many positive cards. We got the clover, we got the anchor, the fish. Scorpios are gonna be leveling up. Scorpios are going to be following their heart. And this is after you guys have been through so many trials and tribulations, especially with this mounted energy here. There was one more thing that I wanted to point out, but I wanna clarify this. Why is this here? Yeah, you're definitely going to be getting some communication out of the blue. And this is from somebody who has done you foul. Like they may have done some things to make you even question if you could date again. And they could be coming back and finally giving you the key to either let the situation go, let go of resentment, let go of that experience. But this is actually going to be more liberating than anything. But this is what I see. I hope that this reading was helpful and did give you some insight on what may be coming down the pipeline. If you did take something from this reading, definitely feel free to thumbs it up and subscribe so you never miss a beat. And I will see you in the next one.